Hi, my name is Chloe Weaver, and today I will discuss the upgrade and renewal process for annual AMI subscriptions. I will cover upgrade and renewal scenarios, walk through the seller process of creating the AMI annual upgrade or renewal, and walk through the buyer process of subscribing to the upgrade or renewal offer. First, let's look at some common upgrade and renewal scenarios. A private offer upgrade or renewal is needed when the buyer needs something different than what they are currently subscribed to in AWS Marketplace. There are four reasons to facilitate a buyer upgrade or renewal for an annual subscription. First, a buyer may require an upgrade or renewal when they would like new or different terms than their current terms. Next, a buyer may want a different price for each dimension or instance type they are subscribed to. The buyer would like a new or different duration, or the buyer would like to renew their contract before the existing contract ends. The buyer's previous AMI annual subscription does not need to be canceled in order to subscribe to the new offer, and when a buyer subscribes to the new private offer, it will completely replace their current subscription. The buyer's process to upgrade an AMI annual subscription will differ based on which of the two billing method methods is used in the current subscription. The first scenario is when the buyer is subscribed to the public product or a non-FPS private offer. In this scenario, the buyer can choose to subscribe hourly and be billed monthly for their usage or purchase their desired instance types and quantity and be billed upfront. The buyer can upgrade and purchase additional quantity at any time if the private offer has not expired. The next scenario comes into play if the buyer is subscribed to an AMI annual private offer with a flexible payment schedule or FPS. In this scenario, the buyer subscribes to a private offer that includes the quantity of each instance type and payment schedule. The buyer's licenses are dictated by the number of licenses per instance type in the second offer. To upgrade, the buyer must accept a new private offer to change the quantity of instances or instance type that they are subscribed to. Note, the payment schedule associated with the previous subscription will remain intact. How do I upgrade or renew AMI annual subscriptions without a flexible payment schedule? To upgrade an AMI annual subscription without FPS, the buyer first needs to sign into the AWS account that they used for the initial subscription. The buyer will then navigate back to the offer, review, and click accept terms to subscribe to the offer. Note, if the offer is expired, the seller must extend the expiration date to reactivate it. Next, they will enter any additional quantity of licenses, then click add, and then click create. Finally, they will review the contract terms and select Confirm. The buyer will be billed up front for the annual amount they subscribe to and for the additional purchase licenses, as they are not prorated or co-termed with their existing contract. Any other associated accounts that need to utilize the private offer and licenses must log in, navigate to the private offer, and choose Accept Terms. How do I upgrade or renew AMI annual subscriptions with a flexible payment schedule? To upgrade an AMI annual subscription with FPS, the seller must create a new private offer with the new quantity of instance or instance type that the buyer would like to subscribe to. Private offers can be created from the Offers tab of the AWS Marketplace Management Portal. Please note, if the customer is subscribed to a private offer with a payment schedule, the payment schedule from this offer will remain intact, but the licenses will not. To ensure that the buyer is not double charged, the new offer should be created for total number of licenses per instance type and the upgrade amount that does not include the initial payment schedule. Once accepted, the buyer's licenses are dictated by the number of licenses per instance type included in the second offer. The buyer will continue to be billed per the payment schedule in the initial offer, if applicable, in addition to the payment schedule included in the new offer. How do I subscribe to a new AMI annual private offer? To subscribe to the new AMI annual private offer, the buyer will complete the following steps to subscribe. First, 
The customer will sign into the AWS account they want to use to subscribe to the private offer and then navigate to the private offer. From there, they'll choose Accept Terms and then Review Pricing. Next, they'll choose Accept Contract and finally choose Confirm. As with non-FPS private offers, any additional associated accounts that would like to benefit from the private offer pricing must also sign in, navigate to the private offer, and choose Accept Terms. Thank you. If you have any further questions about subscribing to AMI Annual Private Offers, please reach out to mpcustdesk at amazon.com.